Hello my friends and good morning. This is Austrian Stacker. I hope you're all doing very well. We are going gold shopping in Vienna. Stay tuned.
Hello my friends, we are back home, so let's see what we've got. I bought this one and actually I also had a lot of things in my post box. Um, I know I've been on business trips for quite some time and I found a lot of things in my post box after I've returned. But I will make a different video, for example, on this thing. And I will definitely make another additional video on this little thing and I also had this in my post box so let's start with this one first I went to a company in Vienna today called Filoro and it was a great experience um, the waiting queue was quite long but I think that's usual on a Saturday morning because usually all the people working during the week, they appreciate precious metal dealers and coin shops um, that open the shops on Saturdays. So because then also we can go into a shop and we not always have to buy online. Um, it seems like a lot of people are buying gold at the moment because actually most of the one ounce gold coins were sold out there. It was really interesting to see. So they have a display where they are showing what they have in stock and actually most of it was sold out so i'm very happy that i got what i wanted to buy there and this was this beauty a 2023 britannia i wanted to have one um, if you want to know all the details why i wanted to get a 2023 britannia I think it's best if you go to Backyard Bullion's uh, channel. He shared a lot of information on the mintage and so on of the 2023 Britannia. It's the last one with the Queen's effigy on it. So I definitely needed to get one. Unfortunately, there's a few scratches, but you have to live with this if you buy bullion and if they take it out of the tube, but that's okay. I mean, I got it for a really low premium. Also the I like the people working there, they're always friendly, they're always treating you very well, so good customer service. Um, it doesn't matter if you just buy a few silver coins there or if you buy a one ounce gold coin or if you buy 10 one ounce gold coins or a big gold bar, they always treat you very well and yeah, they have good expertise so you can also ask questions. Um, I really like going there, I can just recommend if you want to buy precious metals in Vienna. Filora is definitely one of the shops. Yeah, I would send people asking me for a recommendation. So, as I said, this was the first kind. I bought a 2023 Britannia. You can see here there are a few small scratches, but that's okay. It's all in in the end. Then, this one I've ordered from Auragentum from Germany. These are two quarter ounce Britannias. Also 2023. As you know, if you follow my channel, one of the challenges I'm working on at the moment is filling up this quarter ounce, uh, this tube of quarter ounce gold coins. So what I will do now is I will put these two into a capsule and then let's see where we are at the moment. So as I said, I've put them in capsules. So both of them are 2023. So let's see what we have in this tube already. We have Philharmonic, one more Philharmonic makes two, one more three, one more four. Then we have a Yale, 2023. We have a 
Lion of England. Oops. A Lion of England. We have one more Lion of England. And we have a 2023 Britannia. And then we have two more 2023 Britannias. That means altogether we have one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. So, half of the tube is already full. And actually, I have one more thing to show you. I got mail from my awesome friend Cornworld UK. Thank you very much, Dale. I have no idea why you sent this to me. Um, was it a go or, or I have no idea. This is a whole list of, of things. And what I've got is an awesome banknote from Venezuela. I got an awesome banknote from Uzbekistan. How cool is that? A banknote from Uzbekistan. And one from, I think it is Cambodia. Yeah, it is Cambodia. Have a look, beautiful banknote. And I got a lot of coins. Look at that. should be from India, I think. Then we have another one from India. And this one from 1916. This looks very much like Egypt. I'm not sure, but I'm, I'm, I think this is from Egypt. This is, should be Belgium. And one more, this one. Half a franc. This should be France. So thank you very much, Dale. Awesome. I mean, I'm, I don't know what to say. I love it. Thank you so much. Um, how do I deserve that? Um, um, did, did I win a go or, or did I miss something? Or is this a gift? Or th Thank you so much. But please let me know how I deserve this. <laughs> thank you very, very much. I wish you all a great weekend. Please stay safe and healthy. And I hope to see you next time. Servus. Yeah.